Now, nothing can actually guarantee you a good job, but having a degree from a leading university can sometimes help swing the balance in your favour. Well, in the current competitive climate, getting good grades is essential to secure a place at top universities around the world. And if you're lucky enough to have a private tutor, this can really help. UK-based A&J Education is a service that provides tutors across many subjects to help students catch the attention of admissions officers. Well, with us is uh, Sonny Jane, who is founder and chief executive at A&J Education. Welcome to the programme, Sonny. Good to have you with us. Good morning. Um, so, what made you start up a, a, a firm like this when actually there are so many tutors and tutoring companies out there? Um, you know, that's a really good question. I, I, I still think about it today. Um, <laughs> but uh, I was a foreign student studying at Oxford, uh, reading material science. Um, and then towards the end of my first year, my, uh, my father went bankrupt. So effectively didn't have any money to, uh, to pay to Oxford. And they told me, well, you either have to, to pay for your education or you have to, you have to leave. And um, me and a friend of mine tried a couple of different things. Uh, we had a club night, uh, which failed. We had uh, fake women leather bags uh, operation uh, that also failed. Had food delivery that also failed. Uh, and then education was sort of an, an accidental business that um, didn't succeed initially, but also didn't die. And so it went for about 10 months and then just exploded on, on the word of mouth and the initial success. As Ben said, there's lots of private tutoring companies out there. It's sort of, certainly not a new phenomenon. What makes yours stand out? How are you different? Um, Samantha, so we're not really a tutoring company. Um, um, we, we do tutoring, but that's one of the, of the three things. So we do consulting, tutoring, and profile building. And as you rightly say, consulting and tutoring is something that a lot of firms do. Um, so where we stand out is um, in the profile building aspect. So a le leading university like Harvard or Oxford uh, would have more than 20 people per place often. And of them, I would say 80% have excellent grades and well-written essays. So students actually stand out by having a unique profile, so a unique CV that makes them competitive and shows to universities that they're interesting and have potential for achievement in the future. I was just reading about the cost. It's not cheap, is it? No, no, it's not. How much is on average for the service? So our fees start at 24000 that's so expensive for a lot of people. That prices a lot of people out, doesn't it? Yeah, 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 it would. Um, we, I would say we're the, at the very top edge of the market where we, you know, I call ourselves an education concierge. Mm. But there are a lot of companies out there, a lot of my um, friends who work in the sector, they make a lot more money, but they build it in scale. So they have, uh, we only have about 40, 40 families who we look after. Um, many players have a thousand, couple thousand. But do you not have a situation there where you're giving people an edge who can afford to buy it? And so, in some ways, inequality ends up becoming worse. Yeah, definitely. Fundamentally, you, you know, if, if you remove the uh, sort of the, the dressing, the businesses, you help people who already are wealthy to advance their privilege by helping their children to, uh, to get a life insurance policy by getting best education. And that's something that I wasn't entirely comfortable with, mm. which is why we started an access scheme. So we do the exact same thing, but to UK citizens between ages 15 and 18 who are eligible for, for free school meals. And in fact, if someone's watching it right now... And how many people you, do you help? So this year, at the moment, six. Um, normally we have about 10, uh, 10 per year. Here. And how much of a difference does it actually make? What's your success rate of people using your service and getting them into the top universities in the world? Um, it, it depends on the length of time that we look after a student and the university they're going for. But let's say an average success rate for an Ivy League university in America can be um, as low as 5%. Uh, with us, if, if a student's with us for at least two years, um, it averages out just over 80%. Okay, it's a big gamble, isn't it? 24000 to $200,000 in cost. Sunny, good to hear about your business. Thank yeah. you. Thanks for coming in. Thank nice you. To see you. Uh, in a moment, we'll go through.